welcome back to another episode of Talk to with Ryan, and today I will be previewing the game, Union's game against DC United, and today I will be dropping a big goal on you guys. We want to get 50 subscribers by June 8th. Now that sounds kind of hard, kind of not hard. I'm not sure what you guys think about that. Let's get to 50 subscribers by June 8th. We currently stay at 37 subs. Let's make that 50 by June 8th, and um... If we do hit 50 by June 8th, um, then I will do a, do a video reacting to my first video and a couple more. Um, as you can see, I've lightened up on camera from saying, The Union will take on Eastern Conference rivals, DC United, in a clash. I've become more uh, comfortable in front of the camera, and I just love making these videos. So thank you guys for being... Uh, if you're one of the 37 subscribers that have been watching this from day one, I'm very thankful for all that, and um, I just love making these videos, I love the Philadelphia Union, and this is why I'm doing it. So, June 8th does mark the one year anniversary of Talk Dupe, so that is why I'm hitting, attempting to get 50 subscribers by then. If it doesn't work out, um, it's cool, I still want to get 50 subscribers somehow, but, I mean, whatever. Um, but anyway, we'll start to get into the soccer portion of this, but before I do that, we have to do something important. Bedoya Box. He is currently in the room. The Philadelphia Union won 3-0 against Red Bull. Therefore, we must move Bedoya Box out of the room so the Union can get the dub against DC. Now. If the Union do win against DC, that will be nuts because the curse of the Bedoy Box will be legit and Bedoy Box will never be in a video again because the Union will be undefeated since the Bedoy Box has, has not been in a video. Let's just talk about DC. Um, so, they have a lot of key players and um, they've been a pretty solid team so far this year. Um, you know, they got guys like Luciano Acosta. Um, former Union player Sebastian Latou. So those those guys could happen to be dangerous and score goals against the Union, but uh, you never know. Seba, uh, Jim Curtin has spoke highly about him, uh, and he, he the stats have shown for Seba, and I think he's gonna probably be in the starting lineup against Philly. And um, Luciano Costa, Argentine playmaker, um, very good player. Um, I could assume he gets a start. I believe that Steve Birnbaum is questionable. Uh, he does have a concussion, and Bill Hamid with, has a groin injury, so he is also questionable. Two key guys, part of their back line, that uh, you would not want to mess with because um, Bill Hamid is a beast back there, uh, even though he's on DC. I hate to say that. But, and Steve Birnbaum, he, um, he's also a very good defender. So, um, still a lot of, still, if those guys are out, that, that will be pretty, pretty good for the Union, but we also have some key players that might not get, um, in the first 18, guys like Roland Alberg, uh, left quad strain, I believe it was, Red Gaddis has like a shin contusion or something, so, uh, Chris Pontius also has a little minor foot problem, he, I think he'll be good to go, uh, Jim Curtin was just mentioning in his co conference that he's a, um, tough player, and I think he'll, he'll be good to go. So hopefully those three guys can get in the lineup or the first 18, but I would not be against seeing Adam Najum and or Keegan Rosenberry back in the starting lineup. Those guys are uh, two solid guys I haven't... Two solid guys, um, Adam Najum and uh, Keegan Rosenberry. We haven't seen much of Adam Najum, but we have seen Keegan Rosenberry, and we know what the, they those two can do. But, um, Adam Najum has been looking really good for the steal. And I think if Alberg is not good to go, Najem is uh, ready to step in, and hopefully he'll get he'll uh, have some success against DC. And, and uh, this will be the Union's last trip down to DC, um, RFK. I mean, so uh, hopefully, hopefully we can get the dub at the last visit at RFK. Maybe the curse of the Bordeaux box will shine through again, and the Union will get another victory. Uh, and credit, congratulations to CJ Sapon. Uh, with the hat trick, I, I didn't really thank you guys for the all the um support on that last video. Hundred, I don't even know how many views. Let's see, check it out. YouTube here, talk to Beth Ryan. Um, 
so we hit 116 views that is incredible so thank you guys for all those view uh views and support so thank you guys for watching and see you next time on talk to be trying did i miss anything no, i think i'm good so see you guys next time on talk to be trying